Hi, I'm Scott Ross. I'm from Goldfinch Tavern here in Seattle, Washington. I'm gonna make a cocktail here for you using rhubarb and cucumber dry sparkling. We're also gonna use a little gin, a little sherry, some Thai basil, Thai peppers, some pineapple, and some lime. Start off, I'm just gonna add a little bit of the Thai chili. This stuff's pretty strong, so you wanna use it very sparingly. If it's too intense for you, go ahead and go for jalapeno instead if you want uh, something with a little kick, but not as much. Also, we're gonna put in three to four pieces of this uh, Thai basil. And to finish it off, we're gonna get three to four chunks of pineapple. And this is gonna be the base of your cocktail. We're gonna give it a nice little muddle. With this muddle, you don't have to be too gentle like you do with mint. Thai basil is pretty tough, so it can take a beating. Uh, we're gonna muddle it until it's just nice and incorporated. Right there looks good. And then from there, we're gonna add our halcyon gin. We're gonna add a little Listau and Rama Fino Sherry. And then half an ounce here of the uh, lime juice. All right, beautiful. All right, so from here, we're gonna just add some ice. And with this cocktail, you're gonna wanna give it a nice hard shake so those, all those flavors just really incorporate together. And here we are. All right, that feels good. All right, and so when you are straining this cocktail out, you're gonna to wanna to double strain it just so you get all those bits and pieces out of there. If you like it floating in there, that's fine. I like a cleaner looking cocktail. There we are. You can take time with this. Make sure you get every last drop because this is the good juice. There we are. Now I'm gonna add the rhubarb and cucumber dry sparkling on top. Give a nice little refreshing piece here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna add equal parts of each. Um, with the rhubarb, I get this nice earthiness, kind of rustic quality, and the cucumber is going to bring us a nice herbaceous and sweet, lighter kind of style. And then there we are. To finish it off, I'm gonna add a little Thai basil. Go for the bits with the blossoms and a straw. Now all you need is a patio. If you're looking for something to drink that's a little complex uh, and light in alcohol, why not try drinking sherry on its own or a little vermouth? It's light, it's refreshing, it's low alcohol, and also you can top it off with a little uh, dry sparkling as well. Mm -hmm.